So the first one I want to show you is this one right here. It's the Yamaha CLP625 Clavanova. It's the first one in the range, and for the price you get a lot. It's a really great quality piano. Um, I'll play you the piano sound now. As you turn it on, it will sound like this. CFX Grand, which is a £100,000 concert grand piano, right here on this. And the touch of the keys, I have to say, is really impressive. It's got something called synthetic ivory key tops, so they are weighted just like a real grand piano, um, which forces you to play a little bit harder, but that's a good thing, because as I say, it's like a real acoustic grand to play. Um, and this model in particular has something called escapement mechanism, which is a little bit, I'll show you if I turn it down, a little bit of resistance on the keys. I don't know if you can see that, but when I play the keys just lightly, as you get halfway down, there's a slight bit of resistance just halfway, and that is mimicking what a real grand piano does, and just gives that little bit more realistic sensation when you're playing. Um, back to the piano sound. As I say, you've got the CFX grand when you turn it on. faultless, really, really nice sound, but then you have actually got 10 voices built into this, so you have got a couple of um, variations on the piano. The second one is the Bosendorfer, which is a very different, softer grand piano sound. Very, very different. I'll turn it up a bit. Really nice for sort of classical, if you're composing TV music, it might be nice to get some sort of soft piano sound like this. But then you've got things like electric pianos that you can scroll through to. If you're doing jazz, perfect for that sort of thing. Um, you can even put two sounds together, like a, an, an orchestra. So you could have a piano on the on the on the main instrument, and then you can have a layer of strings, which is quite nice, like this. Can you hear the strings? Sounds awesome. Um, and that's it, it's very simple, it is made for um, those of you that just want to focus on playing piano, you're not fussed about having lots of bells and whistles, styles and rhythms and things, this is very simple to use, looks great, sounds great and it's not really going to break the bank account as well, um, And because it, it's really affordable, but you get a good quality instrument at the same time. Um, another thing I will just add, you can record on it too, so if you're learning a piece you can record a right and left hand, just another little tool that will help you learn. <laughs>